All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching I Know What You Did Last Summer. Now, I know two things about this movie. One, it's from the same writers as Scream, so it's very, very similar. And so this is probably gonna be pretty good. And so I'm really excited for this movie. Now, the second thing I know is, okay, if you're like a really, really OG of this channel, you might have at one point seen my scary movie reaction video. That, okay, okay, you already know where I'm going with this. That was like my third video I ever made for the channel, okay? I didn't know what to do. I was just like, oh, let's do, let's do this one, you know? And so we did it, right? Now, I know scary movie parodied I know what you did last summer. So, but it was mostly based off of Scream. So very minor spoilers, not really to be honest, cause I don't even really remember a scary movie if I'm being honest, but as like we watch it and if we see a part come up, I'm like, oh yeah, that was in scary movie. I don't even know what I know what you did last summer is really based off. I know it's like a murder mystery. I'm pretty sure, I think. If it's really similar to Scream, then yes. I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this movie. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that'll be available on Patreon, as well as early access to the next couple movies that I do will also be available on Patreon or YouTube membership. So click the join button down below. But anyways, let's get started. Don't do it, buddy. Hmm, forge your line. Okay, I kind of do remember this in Scary Movie, like... Yeah, oh yeah, they were up there. And yeah, the, her boyfriend was up there too. I can't get this a slime. <laughs> How about I take you out before you leave town, you know, kind of a bon voyage thing. You know what? I, I don't I don't think so. Well, we've been friends since forever. Now you can't okay. just leave without a farewell, right? Yeah, this is our farewell. See ya. To our last summer of immature, adolescent, Decadent. Yo, chum bait. Take a hike. Nice. Yeah, this dude's a weirdo. Oh, he wasn't decapitated. He was gutted with a hook. Look, you're all wrong. They get back to the girl's house and they find the lunatic's bloody hook in the car door. Hey, none of it really happened. It's a bullshit ghost story to begin with. It's true. Yeah, I don't think so, Ray. I swear it. No, oh, Ray is his name. Same name as uh, one of the Wayne's brothers in the Siri movie. <laughs> Ray was my favorite. <laughs> Jesus! You can't drive for shit, you know that? Mmm, yep, this too. He was like, I love when you play in my ass, and she was like, I'm not. And it was just Ray. I guess that part's not one <laughs> Oh, yeah! They hit somebody. And okay, that's what it was. Okay. Jesus Christ, my fucking car! Bro, that was your fault. <laughs> like, Fuck! can't you see where you're going? Oh, not the beamer. Oh my god. Mm, the boop. No, there's no way. Mm. <laughs> okay, what was homeboy doing in the middle of the street? Or in the middle of this road right here? Or in the middle of nowhere? Like, what the f is he? What the f was he doing? <laughs> I mean, it's not his fault, but like, still, like, I, I'd be very curious to know. I think he's dead. <gasps> wait, what is, wait, is this the dude who... And from the very, like, first shot of the movie? Obviously, he didn't jump, but he could... Oh, wait, no, a different hair. Face is all messed. I was gonna say, he could have been, like, walking back. He was crossing the road in the middle of the night, okay? It was an accident. You weren't drinking. Liquor all over the car. But you're sober. They'll never believe I was driving. Well, tell them the truth. They'll believe us. Manslaughter. All right. <laughs> if there's some of him on the car, there's some of the car on him. They're gonna trace it back to you. You're looking at a hit and run. What do you mean there's some of the car on it? How would there was no way they traced the car? No, there's no way. I would call Cap. I call Cap. You're super paranoid. You're like, no, there's no way we can dip. The undertow could carry him out to sea. This is your future, Julie. Think about it. With your scholarship. He's already dead. If we go to the police, we're dead too. So, Julie, uh, you got this car trouble? Guy, yeah, dude. You know, it doesn't look so new anymore. Daddy's gonna be mad. <laughs> what can I do for you, Max? You can wipe that my shit don't stink grin off your face. Cool, bro. You can keep driving. <laughs> like, no one wants you here. You almost got that rich boy act down, right? We'll be seeing you, Max. Bro, I, don't, I hate this dude already. <laughs> this dude sucks. Mm, he's a fisherman, huh? That's why he's around here. Should we check his wallet and see who he is? Why? I don't know. Just to know. Eh, 
It's not really healthy for your conscience. On Barry, it's not too late. You shut up. Just shut up. Christ already, I'll do it. <laughs> yeah, he's not dead. Oh shit, we had yeah, we had to yeah you, you have to get that. Oh my god, give me that. <laughs> okay. If he doesn't die from this and he's he comes back and tries to kill us, this fool is literally Michael Myers. Right here and now we take the Sora grave. Don't you noise your head, you fucking say it! Yeah. Oh, okay, that doesn't sound really too reassuring. Alright, okay, and then I think this is where Scary Movie, like, stops. Maybe they might, like, revisit one more thing. Welcome home, dear. I missed you. She doesn't want to be back. She remembers what she did last summer. What happened to my daughter? Your father must be turning over in his grave. <sighs> Jesus. Why would you say that? Ooh, <laughs> I know what you did last summer. I don't think it was that dude, Max, who sent that, because that would be too obvious. So somebody found out through word of mouth. So one of the other three people said something. Unless when Max drove off, he didn't actually drive off. He kept like watching from a distance and saw what they did. I don't, but I think that'd be too easy to guess. There were no witnesses there. So if it's not Max, he just kept driving off. There were no witnesses there, so. Whoever sent this found out their word of mouth. So one of the other three talked and said something to someone and then, yeah. Fact check, Julie. Helen doesn't have a New York number. If you need to speak with her, I suggest you go to Women's Fragrances, 10 feet to your left. Ooh, all right, she's still here then. She's right there. <laughs> Somebody knows Helen. How? Julie, we were so careful. Were we? Not really, no. We can't just ignore it. Come on, Julie. How do you know this is even related? You did a lot of things last summer. Yeah, well, only one murder comes to mind. Yeah. Shut the hell up! Mm -hmm. We didn't murder anyone. He was still alive when we dumped him in the water. Barely. Doesn't really make it any better. But... His name was David Egan. He was found three weeks after we... His body was caught in a shrimp net not far from Miller's dock. Damn. Okay, let's suppose somebody was there that night. Why send a letter one year later? Max. Max, what, you think? Who no. Was... See, it would be too easy. No. Unless the movie's just gonna make us think it's not Max. Like, tell us something like, oh yeah, then there's no way it's him. But then they're just gonna come back to it later. <laughs> and it ends up being him. Yeah, what? Ooh! Shit, we got your little letter. What are you talking about? Don't fuck with me, Max! You mm. saw us that night. Don't don't say it. Don't say anything. Just in case it's not him. I'll fucking kill your ass. I got no problem. Oh, get the fuck off, off me! Get off of me! Understand? Ah. Yeah, you can't really bring it up to him because just in case like he doesn't know about, it, you don't want to admit to anything. But like, don't you test me, motherfucker! Bro, you weren't gonna do shit. All the cops on your college quarterback ass. Yeah, that's all you're gonna do. Nothing yourself. What did you do? I took care of it. Okay? I scared the shit out of him. All right. Look, I thought a lot about last summer. I know you hold me responsible. No, I'm responsible for my own actions, and I don't blame you. But I don't want to know you either. Ooh. But yeah, I'm like, drop too much. Bro, why is he walking like that? He's literally walking like this. <laughs> like, what are you doing, bro? Stop! Fuck! Be more careful. Oh, he's about to get murdered right here, is he? Yeah, so whoever sent that letter is about to murder him right here, huh? They're gonna kill him off now so he can come back later. Mm. Oh, shit. Damn. Yeah, this fool is literally Michael Myers. All right, he didn't die. Then whose body did the police find? Well, all right, okay, that's a legit death. That wasn't like a fake out death they could have got us with. Spoiler alert, but in a recent movie, a very similar thing happened where a character died and then, uh, I don't want to say what movie, just, but if you know, you know. Hello? Mm. Oh, wait, this wasn't scary. 
<laughs> that was not scary movie. I know. But it wasn't a picture of his dick or something. Hmm. Bro, this would be terrifying. Someone just toying with you like this. My fucking jacket. so tough i mean yeah dude jumping and jumping and timing would be so fucking hard that'd be so hard to do <laughs> what are the choice you got i'm at least trying Help me! Help me! Please don't. Hmm. all right well, i guess that place is dead all right i'm kind of calling bs on this dude getting his revenge because how does he do know who everyone is know where to find them and everything like yeah he woke up for like a second but not enough to like really memorize all their faces and then no. oh he's not dead i mean i'm assuming it's the same guy that they killed because why else would, who else would be doing this and why like i said we find the fuck who's doing this and have a little one-on-one -on -one. what like last night bear fuck you no barry's right yeah Exactly. If we bait him to coming to one of us, whoever is next on his list, whoever he wants to come after next, and we f jump his ass. We kill him for real this time. Susie Willis died of drowning. Uh. She was trapped in a car after it skidded out of control in the reefs near Dawson's Beach. Hmm. The driver David Egan was unharmed. Okay. Like two summers ago, Susie was engaged to David. They were going to be married. I remember he had her name tattooed on his arm. I saw it. Turn right. Where? Back there. <laughs> Thanks. It's like my friend's giving me directions. I'm driving and then like we're on the freeway and he's like, oh, that was your exit. And I'm like, oh, you're telling me as soon as we're like. <laughs> what if they're waiting for us? What if they recognize us? They could have a gun, shoot us dead. Yeah, this is pretty dumb to come. All right. Mm -hmm. okay, Jody Foster tried this in a skin ripper serial killer at the door. Mm-hmm. So many Jody Foster references recently. A lot of things we launched. Let me see why. Well, it was a good try. Yeah, let's go. Can I help you? Oh my fucking god, that literally scared the shit out of me. Hmm, <laughs> is, is that our guy? Same code, right? Ah, uh, it's hung up. Your name, Egan. Sounds very familiar. Did you have a, a brother or something? Mm -hmm. I did, but he was younger than me. David. What class was he? I uh, 92, but he's dead. He died last July. Things just haven't been the same since he died. You know, oh, I think wait. I remember David. Oh, wait, that was he the dude who uh, was in the beginning. Same. That was the same haircut. Okay, so let me see if I got this right. So she said David and Egan was her little brother who died last summer, right? And then those pictures of them together, that was the dude from the beginning who... Okay, that dude is from the beginning of the movie, and then those pictures didn't look nothing like that fisherman at all. Killed a man and then ruined the lives of everyone he knew. You're giving us way too much credit. Hey! Oh my fuck! You forgot your cigarettes. Jesus Christ, I... Oh my fucking god, dude. I wanted to just fucking snap back, but my dog is right under my, laying right by my feet, and I would have ran her over with my chair, so I didn't. And oh my god. Oh, oh my god, how is she not? Oh, the timing, the timing of that. Dude, I'm just, I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for the jump scare. Well, Dad, put me in charge of the store, and I want you there by 10. I can't. The outgoing queen has to ride in a parade prior to the pageant. So very pathetic. Yeah, you're just mad because your power play didn't work. <laughs> Bro, is he about to just kick it in the, the closet? <laughs> Oh, yeah, she didn't fall asleep with that tiara on. <laughs> oh, he cut her fucking hair. Well, not all of her hair, but a good amount. 
Ooh, soon. Ah. That's terrifying. This movie's, this movie's really good. I'm having a lot of fun. What the fuck? Oh my god, what? Oh my god, it's a bunch of crab. Wait, who the fuck was that? That was Max. Oh my damn, that is diabolical. Don't ask me that again, he was dead. Watch it all be gone now. It's, he came by and cleared it all out. Yeah, I don't hear him anymore. No, no way, they're all gone. No way, no way, no way. Oh my fucking god. How? No, there's no way it would be that clean in that amount of time. The crabs carry him away? I swear to god. I mean, unless she was hallucinating, but... Alan's head, he's fucking with us! Come on, Julie, let's go back to... In that amount of time, he had to clean the trunk? There's no way. There's no way. For that. He's just out there, and he's watching us and waiting. What are you waiting for, huh?! That could have been him driving by honking at you when you were in the road. So then he knows that, like, you pulled over, got your car, dipped. <laughs> what? Wait, what? Stop it! It's not him. Grit. No, wake up, Julie! He's behind this! How many fucked up fishermen are out there? Look, he's after me, too. I got a letter. Oh, you got a letter. Why did you say anything? I got run over. <laughs> Helen gets her hair chopped off. Julie gets a body in a trunk, and you get a letter? That's balanced. What body? What are you talking drop about? Drop the act. Max is dead? He's either just really bad at acting, <laughs> or it's definitely him. <laughs> but I don't get why he, he would do it. We well, think his name is Billy Blue. Missy said there was a friend named Billy Blue. Mm. Okay, that wasn't that scary. Okay, that, that didn't get me. No. Mm, okay, that's him. That's him right there. Okay, based on like this part of his face that we can see, he looks nothing like David from the dude from the beginning. Unless I just totally misheard what was happening. He was crossing the road. We hit him. It was an accident. No. My brother drowned. I saw him. He had Susie tattooed on his arm. Tattoo? He doesn't mm. have a tattoo on I his arm. I saw it on his arm. Yeah, it's a, it's a different dude. It wasn't your brother. Exactly. That's what I've been, that's, okay, that's what I've been saying. And like, yeah, like, like I just said, this part of this dude's face that we can see looks nothing like her brother. So obviously it's not him. They didn't hit her brother last year. They didn't hit this kid, David. It was a different dude. You can just tell by his physique. It's a different dude. The dude, whoever they hit is a grown ass man. And yeah, it's the dude killing. Get back at them now. Mm. Oh. There's no evidence up here at all. Nah, mm, they missed it. Excuse me. We've been eating this. <sighs> it's cold. Well, we're gonna have to take the alley. Invading them. This time just gonna be a minute, all right? I'm gonna see if this fella needs help. Mm, it's him. It's the killer. Oh. All right, and she's in the cop car. She can't even get out. Mm. Open the door, please. Open the fucking Come on. I'm being attacked. Ah, he's gone. Of course. Yeah, lock every single door right now. I already beat you to it. Ah, R.I.P. Damn! Scaring her body by a hook? Wow, she's just gonna drop her body right in front of her so she can see. That'd be that'd be brutal. Oh god, that's him. <laughs> that jump scare wasn't that good. It was, you could see it coming. <laughs> oh, Jesus. For some reason, that scared me. Dude, you just gotta jump out the window and just eat that fall.
Oh, uh, okay, that's gonna suck, but I'd rather. Oh, we have. Okay, okay, you're fine. Come on. Uh. Mm. All right, go, go, go. He's gonna be around the corner or something. Oh, dude, he's just gonna show up out of nowhere in front of her. I'm running to those fireworks. That means there's people over there. I'm running straight over there. Or maybe that's a setup. I don't know. Oh, go, go, go. No, don't, don't, don't stop. Go. Get in. Oh, my. How is he in front of her? Where did he come from? Damn. I was rooting for her, dude. I really wanted her to survive. Julie, what are you doing here? We didn't kill David Egan. It was someone else on the road that night. Yeah. Oh, but I think Ben Willis killed David Egan. Mm-hmm. You, you think this Willis guy killed David, then we killed him? Yeah, but what if he didn't die, Ray? What if he's still alive? That's exactly what's happening. <gasps> Billy Blue, no f***ing way, Ray. No f***ing way. Oh, my God, it's you. What no. Are you, about? you went to Missy's. You're, you're the friend. You're, you're the fisherman. No, it's not. Dude, this part of his face looks nothing like the fisherman. Hell no. Hell no. There's probably it's probably him and the fisherman then if it, if he is involved. Oh! Oh! Wait, what the? F On the boat, inside. Hurry! Who's this? Some random dude, I guess. Unless he's the dude with the hook, just in a different outfit. Oh, there's that. Mmm. Oh, it's him. Fuck. Yep, yeah, and that was David's. Yeah, and that's why he has it, because he murdered David. Ben Willis. Yep. Good. So you've been doing your homework, too. Yeah, so Ray's innocent. Okay. Shit. Bro, jump off the fucking boat and swim back. I don't care. He's not as terrifying. <laughs> and just a civilian close. And just a regular outfit. <laughs> it's a flare gun. It's not going to do anything. You're going to shoot him and it's just going to bounce right off of him. Mm. Bro, there has to be something in here we can kill him with. Mm, oh. Doesn't mean he's dead, but he's pretty far from the shore. Oh, he's hanging on. Ooh, all this ice. Oh. Damn, this is where he hides the bodies. Ooh. Ooh, good stuff. Hell yeah, Ray. Hell yeah. I'll be so pissed if Ray's actually working with it. I'll be so mad. So was Michael Myers. Make sure he's really dead. Ooh. Oh, 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 shit, oh, shit. Oh, just cut his hand off waxed. Ooh. Yeah, we should have killed. We should kill him this time, but there's nothing we can do now. Like we, just, he'll he'll probably die though, because his hand just got cut off. There's no, there's no way he survives this. There's no way. No one gets me the way you do. I understand your pain. Oh, but she's back in her room. Yeah. Do you have any idea why this man would want you dead? None. No. <laughs> Yeah, no. One year later. What? Oh my god, another note? I'm back. Oh. Just the same exact as the last note. Alright. Psych! You thought. Oh, dude, why is there so much steam in here? Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I still know. What do you mean? I still know. Dude, I'm sprinting out of here. Hell no. Okay, I see another movie. Okay, okay. They just did that at the end right there for fun, I guess. All right, but that was... I know what you did last summer.